All right. So this is Portal 2 single segment. Well, really have much to say for the beginning. It's going to begin the run. And the demo name I'm going to choose because this game requires demo timing for regular submissions. I'm going to make it Team Duan because there's still a competition going on between who's going to have the commentary bias in the Mirror's Edge of AI. So please vote for Team Duan. Please donate all your money towards Team Duan. And yeah, uh, normally run start at the crosshair but I don't think that really matters so I'll just uh, say the run starts now good morning you have been in suspension for 15 days in compliance with state and federal regulations all testing candidates in the aperture science extended relaxation center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. this is five minute tutorial you will hear a buzzer basically when you hear the buzzer Look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic <laughs> of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Hmm. There is a framed painting on Game the wall. Getting called Please out. go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare All at right, the Alright, now that we've done like three inputs. It's now time to wait for like you now feel 20 more seconds. If you suspect then we have to wait for another minute before an input, and we have to wait sustenance. two more minutes Reflect before another input. On this classical music. And that's the beginning of the run. Good. Now please return to your bed. Um, both of them are max on OBS, both audios. Good morning. And I don't know in suspension for nine, how nine, I can boost nine, it up anymore. Nine, nine, nine. Nine, nine. Oh, sorry. Hello? Anyone in there? Ah! Oh, God, God. You look. Terrible. And that was the input. Good. Oh, no, good. wait for another minute. Are you minute. okay? How are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please time. prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all I'm saying. Prepare. It's all fine. All right? Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Just note that the only reason I have not commentary right now is because there's virtually nothing to say about what's going on right now. now you've in fact, been under I'm probably going to leave after the last few inputs in the question, this cutscene. So, of serious brain damage. But yep. don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling. So if you need to take like a pee break to or being told get food or something, do, do it like now. What I'm saying? At all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay. What you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. 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 Okay. You know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Uh, the game starts like two minutes from now. Down. I don't have any. Okay. Look, uh, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. And I am not going to try to make some. The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. I'm just gonna let you enjoy this beautiful cutscene. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I gonna make it through? But I love space. Uh, just, just gotta get through here. Okay, I just gotta concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's gonna be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, see, now I hear that one. I hear that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, after don't worry. this uh, asks, five minute cutscene, as you know, the there are a few cutscenes, but most of them are alike. under two minutes. Right, and after that, this runs kind okay, of interesting. There. 
uh, outside of between chambers, this uh, this is pretty involved speed run over. So I think this is a docking station. Get ready. It looks alright with my, especially with my uh, garbage chops. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. If you're I'm gonna attempt a, a bunny hopper of virtually this. any other source game, Hold on. and you're wondering why the hops look so fuck Almost weird, there. Remember, it's because this game has like very right, different balls. hops, worry, and one of the out. major Seriously, impacts of it is that time. you lose control very easily. Like at speeds of over 350, oh, you're likely to, to just not be able to turn percent. at all. We are currently experiencing technical forward. difficulties due to circumstances of potentially. But uh, yeah, this is where the run like really control. begins. However, and thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre This is where we would be starting basically if uh, so that science we were doing done. the category Even that skips the, the environmental, social, tutorial. economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. I can see how atrocious my hops are. And button -based tests see, I couldn't even turn there. For science, even in a dire emergency. Please note the incandescent particle field across Another the thing to note is that in some, emancipation grill, some of the elevators in this game, you might notice that I stand in front of them. That's because the way this game works, uh... It has random fade, random areas throughout the elevator where it tests if GLaDOS is talking, and if GLaDOS is not talking, then it triggers a fade. So what I'm trying to do in these cases is time GLaDOS stopping talking to a fade. But uh, yeah, this is basically just the intended route. It's really a few chambers from now until the speedrun starts having tech other than bee hopping. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will remind you for an interview. Like how the entire chat is just Portal 2 memers. I appreciate it. Really helps me out. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable, hey, you made it. There should be. Oh. Hello. Hello. Can you see the portal gun? There is a dialogue skip here. So, basically, the way this one works is that. Is that it triggers like two dialogues playing at once, and what it does is it allows one of the dialogues which need to play to cancel entirely, and that allows me to save like 10 seconds because otherwise I'll be waiting at the elevator for like 10 seconds, and it's awful. Uh, a thing to note here is that if it looks like I, uh, this next test is push a cube through a door, in the face of it's because I'm pushing a cube through the, a door. Three, here, I just two, make one. the cube land on the button, but, like, right here, I'm putting the cube through this door because the exit door is now in this open. game, it's possible to get it there, like, on accident, and that would be, like, a soft lock. So what it does when there's a cube in there is it just opens the door for you because you soft locked and we just exploit that to finish the chamber as fast as we can if the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs meteorites or other objects from space Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space. I should have mentioned the things I just did there. But there's a little bit of time here. That although circumstances may appear bleak, the first thing I did after I pressed the button is called the portal stand, which involves staying in the portal while shooting another portal somewhere else. So that means you can just go back through the portal that you were standing in, which is Really useful for stuff like that because you can get up there without anything necessary. 
And the other one is a cube grab, which will be used again here. The same with the portal stand. God help you. Basically, I place a portal underneath a cube, this facility and then the ruins of civilization. Welcome. And then place a portal like in front of me and grab the cube as it's falling through. And I missed that. That's a button glitch, which is hit the button and then a tick later get to step off the button and it tricks the game into thinking that you still on the button. Uh, sorry if I'm talking like really poorly because. I didn't expect to be this far behind in terms of speaking. But yeah. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols. Now we get into the juicy say, stuff because we're doing a skip here. Or concerns about this policy. So first we uh oh, it's not good. So first we get on top of the ceiling and then we Traverse our way over to where Wheatley is normally, uh, over here. And what that okay, does so is me... it allows here. Heavy. this they to stay there, this never, portal to stay never, there. Ever and what that allows us to do is to go through rail, and shoot a portal dodge. over there. But we're and the reason that's fast there. because so otherwise, get ready to right, on the off we would need to wait for him to open a panel over there. On three. Then we need to wait Ready? for him to open a door, One. and it takes like 30 seconds. Two. So we just uh, it's, it's too high. take it's Wheatley really to the bad. end. All right, going on three just gives you too much time. Think like about this. It. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me. Ow. Now I Watch yourself. am not dead. I'm not dead. And then skip putting Wheatley <laughs> into a thing. Stick on the wall over there. Yeah. And I'll basically why this You'll chamber is called Secret oh, Panel. No. Yes, hello, no, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact, whatever you do. No, thanks, we're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. What is the worst portal joke you've heard? I've honestly never heard portal jokes. I did not know this was a game. Probably ought to bring you up uh, to speed on not even, right not now. even joking. We like, to escape. We're gonna have to go I don't hear much of those, probably maybe because I'm part of the Portal 2 community instead of the Portal me. community. Okay, I'm gonna leave my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't, don't go in there. Don't, she's off. She's off. Don't panic. Oh. She's off. All fine. Oh my god. There she is. That was a what a nasty piece of work she was. Honestly, like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up? Uh, do you know who ended up taking her down? Wow, that was really bad. Oh, still held. Jeez. Still being held. You think that's a great job. You've applied. Ah, I just sorry. I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah, I just done it again. Look for a switch. This. Shh. Is the main breaker room. I just soft locked. <laughs> Whoops. I've actually never done that before. So. Yeah, don't worry. It's not big of a deal. Um, cord. Can go on to. And. Speed on something right now. And yeah, escape, we restart. We're going to, have to go through her cool. chamber. And she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's You're off. permitted she's to off. restart she's level off. as of recent because she is. What a nasty having a soft lock just honestly. end a run altogether is just not fun. Do you know who ended up? Do you know? I've only been in two marathons, and both times I soft locked. When I hardly ever normally soft lock, I went slow on purpose. It's the main breaker room. Look for a switch. There we go. It says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Friendly reminder that if I would have died, if I would have died, it would also count as not being single segment anymore. So look at something else. Look at the next. Saying that it's no longer single segment is just unfair. Because it means you have to have a deathless room. Can you see it anywhere? It just means don't, don't quick save. Uh, tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights uh, on. Uh, now I'm about to do the most important skip in the game. Uh, oh, grabbing a loopy saves at least That's, uh, 50 minutes. God. It's quoting God. Oh, look at that! It's <laughs> Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. No. Also, I will also game. have you know that, this uh... Moving up. Okay. No, Having that soft lock means I went too fast, so I'm no, clearly not a noob. Uh oh. 
Obviously. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. All right, stop panicking. Uh, I can, I can still stop this. Um, uh, oh, Sorry, I'm just okay, too good at the game. Not a problem. A A A A A. Let's hope I can. If you're really skilled with Hoopy, you can get. You can get Weebly to go through Hoopy. I've done it once and never again, and I don't know how I did it. Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? Uh, let's try something like this. I don't know. I had it like down there. You did what? When I got it the first time. Oh no! No 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 no! Oh no no no! Uh no! I don't I don't remember how I did it. We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret, but I think we can put our differences behind us. For silence, you monster. I will say though that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up. You must really, really love to test. I love it too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. Okay, as a serious answer, it ends in like... 20 hours. 20, 22 hours, basically. So... From... In EST, noon Saturday to... 6 o'clock Sunday. Six, seven, Sunday. Since obviously no one's gonna give a real answer. Here we are, the incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing. I don't think I hit it. There it is. If you're wondering why I was doing that, it's to skip a dialogue which I obviously didn't skip. There. Good. You had a dual it means portal I can grab the portal gun immediately. The testing area up ahead. If I uh Once testing right. starts, I'm required by protocol. Also these straps are old and bad. To a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. But the important thing is you're back with me. This marathon's going great so far. <laughs> so there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. You spelled plonk wrong. <laughs> Gaming and stuff. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm himself. Now that All right, got that. I forgot how good you if I didn't this. make that, then I would have had you to wait like 10 seconds go. because we have a lot of that portal today. surface stops being portable for a while. So it's good to wait and set that up, which is why I did that. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. Damn. There should be one in the corner. Well done. Here come the test results. That level is really you poorly designed, by the way, because you can just portal right That's to the end. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing You know what that. you're doing? Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon. Congratulations. Uh, this is the... the Most people emerge from suspension. Laser switch glitch the right there. I want to congratulate you on beating the Basically, if you to have two lasers, you need to... Two laser inputs you need to shoot. If you just... Shoot a portal to hit one, and then change it to hit the other for like a tick. It is uh, hitting both at the same time. And if you're standing next one to the moment. door, it'll let it open. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. Oh, 
so feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you There are infinitely better strats here, tank. but I don't do any of them because this chamber is risky as hell. So we just jump on here and when the time comes I just talk to the end. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. And for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. You do not gain me. I will actually you do, but it doesn't matter. This next test involves the aperture science. Better to be safe safely. than sorry. It was part of an Especially in a marathon. How well Here's an interesting That's why I saw flocked, obviously. Real it's too extensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon also, dioxide out of a room. Again, failing to mention things before they happen. So you'll be you know how I took the light off of the wall life. and then put it on the button? The reason I did that was to trigger the dialogue early because for some reason if you put any object on the button it'll trigger the dialogue. So I just triggered it early because that is a long dialogue and you'd have to Let's wait like what the next test 15 is. seconds oh, if you uh, aerial didn't do that. Well, have fun some the air more interesting speed strats to, to be aware of. made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Sorry, I'm still cleaning up uh, the test thing here so is that there's still trash in them, standing around, we smelling and being useless. Place our portals like this. So one of the balls that are thrown as part of the garbage actually uh that was land on the button. I was actually talking about you. And yeah, also, otherwise here we just wait, time, and then so one of the arguably harder really tricks come into play That's in the next chamber. And that is called the re-portal. What, re what the re-portal entails is that as you're falling through a portal, you shoot that portal somewhere else, and it increases your momentum, and allows you to go places. In this case, we re-portal three times. I'm sorry. I'm and really hope it works. Mind. If it doesn't, anyway, we have backup. Interesting science fact. Uh, what? Damn. Okay. All right, there we go. Every test chamber is equipped with an. That was bad, but it could have played out much worse. So that test subjects so. cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything yeah. with you. I honestly feel like I might be behind estimate. <laughs> Just in respect of how generally poorly I'm playing right now and the uh, salt flock. Pretty good. Uh, this last chamber. This is the last this chamber of chapter two, and it's super easy. Remember, super I easy. We just come over here and shoot portals with finish the uh, chamber. That wasn't good. Um, the turbines again. I have to. Uh, get double dialogue. You seem to have I got both dialogue skips. So, well, in there, if you the do a correct combination of like crouches and uncrouches, you can skip like two dialogues because it triggers a trigger like three times. And in that case, I hit both, which is kind of difficult to do. So, good on me. Uh, then the rest of this is doing that, coming over here, and then flinging just by 
popping like that, and then we we'll just sailing through the air majestically, like lasers to piloting a finish balloon. the chamber. Ricochet. This chamber has a good route. It's a beautiful day out. Like a really Yesterday good and really fast day. route. If you solve this next and I don't do it. Maybe I'll let you ride an so I'm sorry. All the way up to the break room. And I'll tell you about the time I saw And it I'm just gonna wait for my friends to flame on me right now. Because it's gonna happen. See the deer today. I did see some humans. <laughs> here, I've got more test subjects than all. Don't worry, Bangara. I know most of these people. Okay. This chamber is uninteresting, are made from but natural light that then I again, in from the surface. this is the preceding one. chamber, or like one of the, the run-killing chambers in the game, it would also set your hair on fire, and that so being do it. Bridge the Gap, mostly because there is a skip that's really difficult to do. And if you fail it, you have RNG, Excellent. and you it saves printed, like 50 seconds, almost. Of which, I was researching there is also a CM to... strat that I'm Do going to be doing, so I'm going to be doing two difficult things trying to help them? and trying to see Did if I can shots? land at least one. Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. Nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel. So the first one... You need a really good hop sequence in order to get through the door before it closes. Good news. I if you don't, what to do you have three chances to get it with RNG. And if that doesn't work, you'll lose 50 seconds. I'm going to laminate your skeleton and Here's the hops. In the lobby. That way future generations cool, can got it. Here's the CM part to have your unfortunate that I was talking about. Perfect. Oh, almost got it. Going to have to repair that too. That's the only attempt I'm going to be making at that. I just wanted to see if I can get the height. Team one, three. Oh no! <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I did not know it spawned you there. I'm pretty sure I've done this before, and I'm pretty sure it's never spawned me there. But I don't know. I figured out what to do with all the money I save recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way, future generations and I missed can it. learn from you how not to have your unfortunate mm. bone structure. Perfect. <gasps> all right so now i showed off both parts of the skip i've shown off the b hop sequence and i've shown off the uh rng aspect of it i'm okay i'll take it i however i messed up the dialogue which means I'm going to be riding the whole entire elevator. So that was a fail. Fine. I, uh... Fine. <laughs> there we go. Okay, probably lost like a minute in that chamber. God. Okay. Everything else should be fine, relatively. You remember them, right? They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh wait, that's you in five seconds. Good luck. 
So here I just skip as much as I can possibly skip. There are better strats, but I don't care. I think I can still get below estimate. Hopefully I can still get below estimate. Uh, with a restart and wake up and a restart and bridge the gap. I'm actually really worried about going over estimate. Daylight at all hours and add adrenal vapor to your oxygen supply. So you may be confused about the passage of time. The point is, yesterday was your birthday. Here we get portals prepared and then... Oh shit. You know how Notice how I throw the cube like that? The reason being is well, that it I've only starts the dialogue when I drop the cube, you. so it's better well, to just more of a belated birthday medical throw the cube and have it well, set up for a tick it's a medical to trigger the dialogue. But obviously I went slow. Present. There are no... Actually, no, there are out-of-bounds. They're not really super major, but... That I think it's made up by what chapter stupid. 8 and 9 are made out of That's not me talking. in the speedrun, right and phone. you'll see on other when people, we get there. Fine. But right here, a scientist has noted that on you it looks stupid. Well, oh, wow, it's... what does a neck-bearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... Oh, wait. So it's right there was a new Still, thing that was called a, a uh, I'm going turret the boost, subjects and where storage. I managed to find a turret, last name. if... If you're woman. positioned a certain way, so like what perfectly is allowed in turret blocker, uh, turret shooting you will just launch you, and that's what we use there. So yeah, and yes, I've self locked twice in this run so far. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise, so I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. This next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. This is basically intended just fast. I bet you think I forgot about your surprise. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your and surprise. And this is in right chapter now. three. After all, I should be done like three minutes ago, I'm but who cares? Just thinking about it. <laughs> Now we're about to get the greatest surprise you've ever seen. Initiating surprise in three. No spoilers though. Two. One. I made it all up. <laughs> surprise. Oh come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. Alright, I'll just slow there just to make sure the cube went through. It's kind of, it's better to just wait and make sure both cubes go through than to have one not go through. Doesn't lose that much time, but it loses a bit. Also, I'm really bad, and I do bad strats. I guess maybe I should explain what I just did in Column Blocker. Because normally you use a bridge to stop the cubes. 
What I did instead was just grabbed the cube while it was being flung, and then the other cube just landed on the ground next to you, and it just works out easily. Yes, Jerry, or maybe your prejudiced work site should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, The next Jerry. lab laser training is basically court, the, uh, just hang in there for, for five basically more intended, except fast and, actually, no. Basically, you grab a cube, which skips the beginning, and then you skip an entire laser chain by just uh, strafe jumping to the end. So that opened the door, so now I just strafe to the end like this. I thought about our dilemma, Easily. and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. That's right. I think these test that chambers was a really good triple laser. They did before. So that uses the. Easy, really. You just have to look at things objectively. That uses the laser so switch glitch again, just like dual lasers, except this time it's three, and sometimes it's really finicky. But this time I got it like really well. I've got a surprise for you after this next test. Not a fake, tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise with tragic consequences. What's going on? Who turned off the lights? Uh, here's just a hey, little buddy. skip. I'm speaking in we an trigger the bridge early, but in an ear, and then we. Metal ball, I can hear you. Run! I don't need to do the voice. Run! <laughs> Then we go through the panel early. I I was really bad, so it didn't save much time, but it's fine. And hopefully I get the hop over these stairs here, because they save a little bit. I didn't. I'm really bad at that for some reason. I usually either over hop or under hop for that, but it doesn't matter too much. Oh, I'm... I'm sorry. I'll actually deal with that right now. I, cause I knew what caused it. I knew what caused it. Come on, come on. It's fine, it's only like five seconds off my time. I just got stuck on Wheatley, what do you feel? Standard grade hops, except those were really below average for me. And this is the end of chapter four. So, yeah. And then coming up is another skip that saves like 15 seconds. Or more, I think. I'm probably behind my some, my uh, estimate already anyway. I can take a few seconds. So here, what we do is... We get on top of this light and mess up. Don't worry, we have multiple chances. So we get on top of here. Uh, go on top of here, and this skips a trigger which activates Wheatley's light, so I apologize, but this shit chamber is going to be extremely dark. They say that the old caretaker of this place went it will get better soon, though. 
So just wait patiently and really try to focus on what I'm doing. Still hear the screams of their replicas, all of them functionally indistinguishable from images. No memory. Oh boy. Bad. I almost got a job down here in manufacturing, but uh, guess who the foreman went with? Only an exact duplicate of himself, Nemesis. Ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the smelly humans. The, the, um, sorry, that's... Oh, I'll tell you, humans? Oh, okay, humans. it gets better right here. And this chamber is RNG, so <laughs> this is like the only true RNG part of this B run. There's RNG with the door skip from before, but that's only if you missed the B hop, and you can still not have to deal with RNG. This is the only part where you need to deal with RNG no matter what, because the way this area works is that there's bad turrets and good turrets and we want the bad turrets to spawn and it's completely RNG as to whether they do spawn also I apologize for how bad that was I just missed a good one I, I just I think I just missed a bad one but another one came so good RNG Response. Only the turret control center. Thanks, Puff. That should do it. Template missing. Continuing from what? What are you? Oh, brilliant! It's br that's brilliant. New template accepted. If we're lucky, uh, this game never gets good. Uh, <laughs> okay, keep your eye on the turret. As in a speedrunner's perspective, answer. Uh, realistically, uh, chapter eight. Chapter. Three gels. The begin. The end of chapter seven is where it gets good. Was there any sort of announcement before open? Like a like a buzz? I like how I speak in map terms when people probably don't know what the maps are because the only reason you would know is because CM or using console commands. I mean, I realize they're children, but still, you know, low hanging fruit and all that. It's fairly science, really. Uh, I'm gonna wait for sure Weebly right because. Don't worry, I'm absolutely guaranteeing you 100%. I. Hmm. No, it's not this one. I got. Okay, I hit Weebly. Right, she can't use her turrets, so let's go Because if you, uh. As well. Go really fast, you can risk getting stuck on Weebly, which loses a lot of time. Not a soft lock, but you lose a lot. Uh, this is cyclical, so depending on my hops, I should be able to, uh, get a good cycle. There are several cycles, and I have, like, not a great one, but one that works. And, yeah, otherwise this is completely intended. Because, you know, if you play this casually, you know, you need to, uh, destroy some tubes. Do you smell the neurotoxin? Hold up, the neurotoxin levels are going down. So what? Hold up, that did it. Neurotoxin. All right, that's my cycle. Yes. Hold on. Warning: Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. All right. Uh, if there's possibly donations, which I doubt there are, if this is a pretty good time to mention them. I assume there aren't, though. <laughs> uh, if there are, and I'm just gonna like, not even care. They should take us right to her. I can't believe I'm finally doing this. Woo! <laughs> I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all, so they say it's not fun at all. And I, I, I believed them. I thought I was a fool to myself. Oh, and I'm, I'm, lo I'm loving this way of a time. This place is huge! I 
really seeing the top layer. I'm out of water. Dang it. Miles. All sealed off years ago, of course. We Don't worry, after this cutscene, there's more oh, waiting. To see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turret. And she then the biggest skip in uh, the entire oh, game on, I, I, is coming I'm up in the next chamber. And that is called the elevator oh, skip. I, I, I'm going the wrong way. Get to her. So find you. what elevator skip consists of is you get on top of an elevator instead of going into it. And then you can skip a two minute cutscene. That's it. Really easy, yet really easy to choke. And I guarantee they'll overestimate if I don't get that at this point. Considering I've lost a minute and bridge the gap and two minutes and wake up. Actually more like a minute and wake up, but whatever. If I'd known you let yourself get captured this easily, I would have just dangled a turkey leg on a rope from the ceiling. Well, it was nice catching up. Let's get to business. I hope you brought something stronger than a portal gun this time. Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh-huh. Seriously, I'm gonna end up getting water. Goodbye. It's okay, there's more cutscene after this. This, is, this area is like all like long cutscenes. And then from that point, there's like no cutscenes up to the end, basically. Uh, unless I fail a trick, of course. I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. I don't know why I'm popping with this. Deadly neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd just sit on here because this stream is poop. And so is this run. Hello. I hate you so much. Warning. Central core is 80% corrupt. That's funny. I don't feel this, good. this game doesn't have surfing. I feel pretty good. Alternate core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking about. To initiate a core transfer. Please deposit substitute core in receptacle. Port. Substitute core accepted. Substitute core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes. Corrupted core. Are you ready to start the procedure? No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. Uh. Stalemate. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Unless a stalemate associate is present to press the stalemate resolution button. Oh, so bad. Think about this. Stalemate resolved. Ugh, not good. Here we go. Wait, what if uh, mock up. Mock surfing. Oh, I didn't think of that. Oh, it will. Believe me, it will. Are you? Are you just saying? Hell yeah. Really you're just saying that, aren't you? You're just. No, you're not. You are. It is gonna hurt, isn't it? All right. This is. This is a setup for the big skip. You're gonna feel the time loss if you. Uh, even if you haven't seen it, knowing what it's. Just knowing what it skips should be enough to understand how bad it is to not get it. <laughs> Assuming I don't get it, which I should get it. But you'll miss you'll miss some uh, story which might be essential for your understanding of what's going on. I got it. We're good. This elevator box is really stupid, and it sometimes just pushes you out outright. But if you know what you're doing, it's normally fine. But yeah. Also, hops feel higher up here. Look at that. That's not normal. So yeah, once this invisible thing disappears, you just go down here. What? <laughs> <laughs> and then that's the end of the level alright so you won't know how bad losing it is cool this would have been explained in the cutscene oh wow I got the I got the good potato where he's just smacking into me it's great Fast 
Oh, don't worry, Tom. We're at the, we're at the glitchless part of the run. Trust me. It's gonna get worse. I've heard that it's possible to soft lock here. Where somehow you soft lock in a cutscene where you have no control. So uh, it's pretty great. Now, chapter 6 begins. That was part of chapter 6, but who counts it? And... Bye bye, potato. Oh no, that hops. So in here, it's just portaling as far as we can. Uh, this saves a few, going through a few places by just doing long shots, and this is a long shot. In and of itself. It's usually not this bad, actually. Uh, there it is. Apologies. Uh, then we trigger these. And then the last thing to do here is to just get into that area before you can access it normally. Yo, thanks for the support. <laughs> really helps me out, Chops. Oh, that was weird. So yeah. The door to get in there normally would have opened like right as soon as I ended. It's like five seconds. There are good strats here too, and I don't do them. So sorry to anyone who actually speedruns this game. Like this right here is bad in itself. But then I don't do the good strats. I mean this strat's fine, but except you can't get it. So that just skips going into a door that's like over there and going through a massive room and such. Pretty simple, I guess. So then we come up here, oof, and fling. Basically intended. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Ooh. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand holding. And this is this is the start of the worst chambers in the entire run, or some of the worst, because this chamber can just be bad. First, there's a button glitch here. If I can get it, if I can't get it, it's not really worth trying again. You might as well just get the cube and go to the button. This is easy. We just 
get up there early. It only saved like a few seconds. And this is where I hate the run. Hate this chamber. I'll try this once. Oh wow, I got it. I did not expect to get it. Uh, and then the last thing, grab that cube. Cool. I did not expect for this to go that well. I didn't intend to do that strat originally. I just ended up doing it and it worked. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively Oh, so I think there are dialogue fades here, but I don't know any of them. So I just don't bother. Uh, this chamber is pretty cool. All these science spheres are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of uh, Actually, not because or your heart stopping. Because that's not part kind of, of boring, I guess. We come over here. I like your style. Coral place down here, and then grab some gel, and then go with it. With that. That finishes the chamber. Up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it, so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing uh, the yeah, more while under stress actually triggers the reaction. This cha this chapter as a whole is actually not that bad. I don't know why I overplayed it like that. It's the next chapter that's really bad. I'll just clarify now. <laughs> There's a lot of tricks in Chapter 7, now, if you're like part a of lot, group Kepler 7, and all of them can mess you up, about the size of a postcard into your skull. but here this isn't even there. too, but too bad, I messed it up, but this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 just degrees, on top so of this need lamp, to do a little bit of a fast. long shot, come down here, do another long, long shot. You need to fall down here to open the door. If you're hearing this, it means you're taking a long time on the catwalks between tests. Uh, something I haven't denoted is that this run permits portal funneling. Uh, which is not a mechanic in this game, or like an intended mechanic of the game. But we're allowed to have a hotkey which turns portal funneling off. Which, if you don't know what portal funneling is, is just blocks you into going through portals a certain way. The reason we're allowed to do it is because portal has it as a feature. So for some reason, the Portal 2 mods thought we should allow it in Portal 2 even though it's not an option. One of the few complaints they have about the way the mods did things, but who cares? I won't get into that now. Congratulations! The simple fact that you're standing uh, shoot here that for listening a while. to me is in the elevator. Uh, then we go up here. You can shoot this through the wall for some reason. I uh, I missed. Wait, what? Oh, I never turned off. Oh, I never turned on portal funneling again. Whoops. My bad. Alright, that's fine. You turn off portal funneling for the specific intent of the last chamber, and then you need to turn it on immediately after. I forgot to do that. Greetings, friend. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Amateur Science. Uh, and then we skip grabbing GLaDOS here by doing a super simple fling. Because normally you have to go into that building and watch a cutscene and grab, grab the potato and put it on our gun. You'll see the potato on the gun uh, in the next chamber. And this is where Chapter 7 begins. And this is where I hate the run. There it is. The testing area is just up ahead. So first of all, pixel shot. And that went so much better than the last one. <laughs> uh, and then I guess the rest of this is alright. I can get fucked, but should be fine. Great job, 
Yep. We're good. Uh, the next chamber, there's trick that's not really hard, but easy to mess up. Especially considering at least one person in this, uh, in the chat. We'll call out names. If you're interested so this is a weird one. There's a thing... I actually don't remember exactly what it is, because it's a combination of two things, I think. Uh, something... If you scroll while having momentum on gel, it'll actually fling you, like... That. Oh, oh that was a bad fling, but it was good. I don't remember exactly what causes it, but if you just scroll while on the blue gel, it'll fling you super far for no reason. I actually waited on the top there to explain it, I don't know why. Uh, the next chamber, the only really difficult part is... Well, I guess there's the hop, but then there's a reportal. And as I've said before, reportals are stupid and hard. So hopefully I'll get it. For staggering your way through aperture sciences. This is a long one, by the way. You've made some real contributions to society for a change. Just in general. Humanity is grateful. If you have oh, bad. We don't want old newspapers and oh, missed. Up the building. Whoops. For many of you, I realize sixty dollars is an I overshot. Windfall, so don't uh, this skips going into a big room. It's pretty good. <laughs> and just so you know, we Since still have not gone out of bounds yet. For all employees, the quality and of our tests I'm pretty sure dramatically. technically the there are no out of bounds. However, has not. Uh, I guess it depends <laughs> on who you ask. Because you definitely go through a wall. <laughs> But whether that's out of bounds or not is questionable. This is the this is the hard part. moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now we're going to see shoot some portal gel over here. And easy. That re portal brought me just high enough where I could get up here. Don't I'm gonna make shut up so you can experience the dialogue. Because this is the best in the game. I don't want your damn lemons! What am I supposed to do with these? Demand to see life's manager! Make life rule the day and thought it could give Kane Johnson lemon! Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemon! I basically ended it, like, as soon as the dialogue ended, so... Wait. Alright, here's a fun glitch. Here's a fun glitch, it's coming. Just, uh, wait a bit. So basically... If you get yourself stuck, and that's why it's called a stuck launch, a certain way, you can build up speed and just fly, basically. It's awesome. There's two in here. The first one's easy. The second one's hard. I'm gonna try to go for both. My portals are completely backwards. I don't like it. We need to stand here and wait for him to see paradoxes. But here is the second stuck launch. It's kind of difficult to align. So back up like this, and then hopefully with the positioning like that. Yep. Got it. Now let's just hope I don't get messed up by tubes! Uh, whoops. This j this tube's bouncy, by the way, and that's why I got messed up. But either way, you can just do that, because this tube's bouncy. You can use it to climb up like that, 
and that skips going over an elevator, which would lose a lot of time. <laughs> And then the next is the last really difficult thing. This chamber has the last really difficult thing. Do I, do I make a sound when I when I'm trying to do hard tricks? I assume I do. For God's sake, oh no. Boxes. Uh, this doesn't matter, because very dialogue-oriented, this part. Like, I was still fast enough to have good enough dialogue. And I'm gonna be at the end, like, really early. Relative to the dialogue allowing the door to open. And then here's the, here's the hard trick. Uh, it's basically a throw a cube on a button. That, that's what it is. I'll try like this first. <laughs> yeah. You have no idea what it's like in this Free. I have to test. All it's kind of like uh, the laser this, switch this glitch itch. thing in that yeah, it must be hard you can have it press on the button for like oh, a tick, well, I'll tell you what, and that'll still be enough for the door to open oh, if you're standing oh, against it. Life. Nothing feels better. It's just I've got a test. I've got a test. So you're gonna test, and I'm gonna watch, and everything is gonna be just. Morning. I've completely stopped caring who calls me fatty at this point. Not like I've ever cared, but yeah. this is ha this is basically casual. This this part here after the heart skip. Uh, I can afford to go slow here. I'll just walk. New tests. Like that. New tests. Gotta be some tests around here somewhere. Oh. Right. So little dialogue skip. All right, here it is. This is the. This is where the run gets interesting. There's a glitch in this game called Excursion Funnel Glitch, where if you crouch while standing still in a funnel, while and then leave the funnel, you'll be able to fly. You'll see right here. It's all right. Everything's good. I just invented some more tests. This is one of my tests. Not entirely. Not entirely. Look at the word test there on the wall. That's I where messed I'm up. <laughs> Dang it. I don't know why that didn't work. Don't matter. That doesn't save time there, but I kept the fly going into the next chamber, so now I have it forever until I touch another funnel. Basically. Yeah, this is where uh, no, flying there saves a lot of time. That, that skips a fair button. bit. Oh, yes. well done. Also, I push the button up like that because it triggers a dialogue early. And yeah. I, <laughs> I just explained it, Shifornee. I'll explain it again. Basically, for some reason, don't don't ask me why. If you crouch in a funnel while standing still, and then depending on what you do, uncrouch if you want. Uh, the game will be tricked into thinking that you're in a funnel all the time, even if you're not in the funnel. But also no flip, so yeah, rip runs over. Eight percent of death. And it saves a little bit here, too, because we would only get the funnel fly, like, now in the old route. This is a fairly new route. It's under a year, compared to most other routes. It's probably the newest, especially the ones that I'm doing. There's a slightly newer one for a couple chambers ahead, but I don't do them, so who cares? 
But, yeah. This is the last chamber with fly for a little bit. Uh, there's still chambers with fly, but don't worry. This skips the entire level. But, also, since I just went into a new funnel, I lost fly. So now I can hop again. It's good to balance when you're flying and when you're hopping, because hopping's fast. But flying can be faster. Also, Fly is a really good place to softlock, just so you know. And yet, for some reason, in my past two marathons, I've never softlocked to anything like that. But I've softlocked to stuff I didn't even consider. It was the same of books. Pages being turned. So that was just what I was doing. Just reading, uh, books. So not a moral. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just know the This is... Wow. Okay. You need to have the cube in the funnel for a little bit. Because otherwise it just kind of moves, gets thrown about a little bit. I lost a bit. Uh, there's two ways. Uh, if you got the fly in the, uh, cham in that chamber. Uh, if you saved it from a previous chamber, you will just always have it until you go into another funnel. But, in the same, in the same level, uh, if you got the fly from a funnel that went through a portal, and then you replace that portal somewhere else, uh, it'll kill your fly. Are you, are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering if... Maybe uh, that will be seen in the next chamber, because there's fly here. All the worst ways. No, no, that wasn't the Ah, what am I missing? But yeah, only only by going through another funnel if you preserve it through another chamber. Uh, this is where a portal will fizzle the uh, fly. There's a dialogue skip there, but I don't know how to do it. <laughs> Uh, three chambers until the best part of the run, in terms of glitches. What I hate about this run is that it's actually, like, a pretty good run, except for the two soft locks. Like it's at, it, like it's actually like close to PB pace. Especially with the good cube throw. Alright, still nothing. Let's keep moving. Sorry about the lift, it's out of service. Might as well, you know, give you the tour. Alright, so now we're in a funnel. You'll see some lights of some kind. Don't know what they do. Um, in terms, well, in terms of glitches, it is the, it is the best part, unless you think stuck launches are better than flies, which I guess is arguable. But then again, flying is no clipping, and no clipping is obviously disallowed. Also, for anyone who is curious, glitch list does not exist in this game. There's a glitch list segmented being worked on for some reason, but that's still in dispute. I'll be honest, 
Uh, I'm gonna wait to get a funnel here because having a funnel here will activate a dialogue which saves like a few seconds. It doesn't save time if you're fast, but I'm not fast, so I just get the dialogue. <laughs> All right, I don't know whether you're uh, you're picking up on what I'm saying there, yes, but thanks, we get it. <sighs> I need to go to the bathroom, but there's no breaks. Damn it! <laughs> Fine, we're good. Uh, last chamber of chapter eight, and this is where the fun begins. We're gonna get a fly here, and we're gonna keep it all the way to the last chamber. Only three more chambers to your big surprise. All right, so we have a fly. I'm on the ground, and now the next the next time we touch a funnel is. Two to three minutes from now. Um, two things to what little ugly Kane said. One, I don't know why you're talking about that in chapter nine. And two, uh, they're they're bad. Those strats are not fun. All right, so. flying now. And the question is, where do we go? We go right here. I wouldn't say this is out of bounds because we go there. We go through this general area just in a different way. Like, there's a funnel that goes all along this. And there's a, a faith plate that not textured properly. But we're obviously not where we should be. Who knows? Sounds like somebody is an RTA fan. Okay, look, I've decided I'm not gonna kill you. Okay, if you come back. I can potentially mess up here. It'd be fine. Ooh, oh, that was actually much closer than I wish it was. Also, that was slow. Oh, I've got an idea. Yes, yes, in your face. I got. Ooh, I think I'm a little bit low. Like low. Yeah, I'm lower than I should be. I think. Yeah, I am. I'm not low enough where I won't. Actually, I will be. Crap. Okay, so. Don't mind me. Continue escaping. So I need to do this, which is okay. Huh. Apologies for the slow. Uh, that's entirely out of my control at this point. Even though it fully was. All right. I lost like ten seconds, but who cares? The dialogue that just went would have triggered like ten seconds from now. Uh, so then we go over here, drop down, that skips a big chunk, and then this is the uh, part where you gel a bunch of turrets, and do we gel a bunch of turrets? Absolutely not. Oh, oh, did it kill you? Wait, what? That would be amazing if it Alright, hold on. Hello? Apologies. Oh, 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 yes, alright, no, just had a brainwave. I'll be back. If you're still alive, I'm gonna be back. Don't die until I get back. So we put them to sleep, and what this does is it makes them not target you for longer. Which is useful and stuff like this. If you're really fast, you can do it without putting them to sleep, but I'm not. Ugh. Um... You were here for the soft lock, right? Uh, he's... Uh, here we, we just skip like 10 seconds. Uh, then there's the stupid, uh... Part where you need to 
bomb some more. Obviously skipping it. Okay, I'll take that as a no oh, that was a weird one. Okay. Uh, we're almost done with the fly. Last thing we do is come up here, level with a funnel, and then fly, just skip the funnel. I don't think I've heard that dialogue in a while. I think I went slow. Who cares? Also, if there's, if uh, the estimate, if I'm five minutes, if I have five minutes left before I'm overestimate, then I'm underestimate. So we're good, I think. Hopefully we're good. I don't want to get patronized. Because, believe it or not, that's what we do here. If you go below estimate, you're gonna get bullied. Just... just facts. Now, the last marathon I've done, I softlocked here, and I didn't even know that was possible. So, now I don't trust standing on GLaDOS at all. According to the control panel light up there, the entire building is going to self-destruct in about six minutes. I'm pretty sure it's a problem with the light. I think the light's on the big, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you, um, as discussed earlier. Uh, so let's uh, about three minutes, yeah, and then to be fair, this is actually, actually a pretty minutes, decent three, run, except for the soft locks. So anyway, that's the itinerary. And the, also, I took the liberty stuck launch the and a couple of bad things in the finale too. Otherwise, this is actually a pretty good run. One, no portal services. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, bombs are throwing at you. You know what? This plan is so good, mm. I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. This is a, a long wait. In five minutes. Okay, don't time out gaming. Gaming, I know, Spitta, I know. Sounded real? No. Yeah, uh, they're fine. Anyone else, I feel free. Because you just to ban, 100%. Uh, this isn't normal. This is not my normal setup for that, but who cares. So here, we're gonna get this core, and a fun way to save time is to go on top of here. And then do that. More corruption at 50%. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four uh, minutes. What, what happened? What happened? What, what, uh, second what core. There's three cores. Hold on. Ah, the bloody bombs are stuck. And yes, in case you haven't pieced it together, this is a boss battle. Quick, what's the situation? Oh no. Oh, hey, are you pretty lady? Warning. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? Quiet. Oh, ah! Uh, then we wait a little bit. Uh, now I guess. Uh, we mess up, obviously. What kind of speed run would this be without a little bit of choke? The world's best name is Craig. Fine. Core we lost like five seconds. And then we're almost done. Manual core replacement. All we need to do is wait for I see. this area to implode on itself <laughs> and then get to are the end to shoot, to the, shoot to the moon. Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no. Did you pick up on my sarcasm? Stalemate detected. I think I'm, 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 I don't know if I'm underestimating, I'm not stream open. <laughs> I think judging from the length that I've been streaming, I think it might be okay. I don't know. Stops oh, now. Space! 
Uh, someone tell me the time I wasn't there. Let go! We're in space! Yo, Kratz, dude, you went on Earth spent 12325. Good. I'm surprised I did with those two soft locks. <laughs> it's, it's, this is fine. Yeah. There's, there's nothing bad going on here. Yeah, alright. Thanks for the run, dude. No problem. Do you have any, uh, anything? Any last words? Probably not, except, uh, hashtag teams one, please donate to help the cause. I, I don't know if you can if you can do that. <laughs> let me let me check the vid war. Might... All right, it's even. I guess I guess that means you're allowed to say whatever. <laughs> sure. Oh, all right. All right. All right uh, up next, we have a uh, Voltium doing antechamber. Uh, I'm gonna go set that up. All right. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, Dilly. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know.